New gear fever is a real thing in our world. You're looking to level up your gear so that you can finally make some more enjoyable films for your audience. I get that. I have that fever myself. But sometimes you just don't know what kind of mistakes you're about to make either because um, you ignore them or because you don't expect them at all. And today I want to present to you my mistake. I spent almost 2000 euros on my new camera and I was very excited that it was going to make my video production process much easier and much faster. And the exact opposite happened. Why? Well, because I forgot to take into consideration one very little thing. My old laptop. The 1080p videos are workable with. You know, if I put them on Premiere Pro and I play them on one-fourth of the original quality, then it's not really clear, but I can see what's happening. Uh, however, the 4K videos that this camera can record are really impossible to work with. They get stuck all the time. I can wait for 10 seconds for the video to play uh, without getting stuck for 3 to 4 seconds, and then it gets stuck again. And no matter how much I wait, it doesn't continue to play the video without getting stuck for more than 6 or 7 seconds. Which makes every 4K video that I shoot, for example, on this project unusable. It's little mistakes like that that uh, need about one or two thousand euros more to you know get fixed. Sometimes, though of course not the day that I was filming it, my computer even completely uh, turns off. It goes away and it needs another ten minutes to turn back on. And since I know that it turns off because it overheats, I've built this little supportive legs to raise it from the table so that it has more space to breathe. But it absolutely doesn't make the video not get stuck though. By the time you're trying to put the first two pieces together, it would have stopped so many times that you just are not inspired anymore to do anything. So the hard lesson that I learned from this mistake is that you should always be prepared to get disappointed. If you're planning to get a new camera, take into consideration that you might need to um, upgrade your laptop as well. You might need new batteries for the camera as well as newer and faster SD cards. It all adds a lot to the cost.